Bart and Kira, that gathering was to remember the life of the woman's ex-boyfriend who died in a car crash four years ago. Now on this very day, family and friends are forced to remember them both. She said, I'll be back, Mom. She not back. Y'all killed my baby. She had a future. The daily conversations with her daughter. I talk to this little girl every day. Sarah, get up. It sound like you're not up. Will no longer happen in this home. I want her to come home. I want this to be a dream where I can go pick her up. Terry A. Adams was one of seven people shot during an overnight gathering for her late boyfriend. She was the only one who died. This picture will never fade away. All I know is when I ran across that street, she was laying by her car in a pool of blood like they slaughtered a hog. Surveillance video showing the moment gunfire erupted on Iowa near Cicero just after one this morning as dozens of people ran for their lives, including Adam's cousin, who was also shot, but in her thigh. She was blessed by God. She had some ear pods in a pocket, in a pocket. So when they cut the pants off her, the bullet was laying right there. The two cousins were running together, trying to get back to Adam's car. She was like, come on, yay, yay, come on, yay, yay. And my daughter just dropped. Security video also capturing the alleged gunman dressed in jeans and a white top as he opened fire before running away, turning the street where generations gathered. Iowa is the block they grew up on, so they come there. Now to a spot with lingering trauma. It's going to kill me to wake up every day to pull up at my house while my baby was killed across the street. Her family says she was supposed to begin nursing school in August. No one is in custody. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.